2 over 3 to power 2 over 3. So simply, let us simplify this solution. Now we know that uh, a to power m over n is equals to nth root of a to power m. And therefore, this here will be equals to third root of 2 over 3 to power 2. So this will be equals to now also from uh, from a over b to power n, this is the same as a to power n over b to power n. We distribute the powers. So this is what it is equals to. So applying this here, this will be equals to root of 3, 2 to power 3, sorry, 2 to power 2 over 3 to power 2. So this will be equals to root, third root of 2 to power 2 is 4 and 3 to power 2 is 9 or 3 times 3 is 9. And therefore this is equals to now from if you have an nth root of a over b this is the same as nth root of a over nth root of b. So from this, now we can write this as third root of 4 over third root of 9. Also, we know that 1 over the nth root of a, this is equals to 1 over nth root of a times nth root of a to power n minus 1 over nth root of a to power n minus 1. Therefore, from this, now this will be equals to third root of 4 over third root of 9 times third root of 9 to power 3 minus 1 over third root of 9 to power 3 minus 1. So this will be equals to third root of 4 over third root of 9 times third root of 9 to power 3 minus 2 is 2. Sorry, 3 minus 1 is 2 over third root of 9 to power 3 minus 1 will be 9 to power 2. Now from nth root of a to power x, this is the same as nth root of a to power x times the nth root of a to power y. This is equals to nth root of a to power x plus y. So applying this here, we shall have third root of 4 times third root of 9 squared over third root of 9 to power so you add this is 1 this is 9 to power 1 so 1 plus 2 1 plus 2 so this will be equals to third root of 4 times third root of 9 squared over third root of 9 1 plus 2 is 3 9 to power 3 now realize this is a third root and here it is power 3 so this power cancels with the root and therefore we have third root of 4 times third root of 9 squared over 9 so this is equals to third root of 4 times third root of 9 squared is 81 over 9. So this is equals to third root of 4 times third root of 81 can be split into 27 times 3. 
So all this over 9, which is equals to, now from uh, nth root of a, b is the same as nth root of a times nth root of b. Therefore, this will be equals to third root of 4 times third root of 27 times third root of 3 over 9. So this is what we have. Now this will be equals to third root of 4 times third root of 27 is the same as 3 to power 3. 3 times 3 times 3. Then times 3, third root of 3 over 9. Now I realize this is three, a third root and it, this 3 is to power 3. So this 3 cancels with the root. And we are left with third root of 4 times 3 times third root of 3 over 9. Now 9 is divisible by 3. So here this 3 cancels through 9 three times. So this is equals to third root of 4 times third root of 3 over 3. Now from nth root of a times nth root of b is equals to this nth root of a times nth root of b is the same as nth root of a b. Therefore, this now here, if we write it in this form, it will become third root of 4 times 3 over 3. So, this is equals to third root of 4 times 3 is 12. So, third root of 12 over 3. Please don't mistake, this is third root. Supposed to be written okay. This is equals to third root, supposed to be like this third root of 12 over 3. So, this is our final answer. This is our answer in the simplified form. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel, it's completely free of charge. Kindly subscribe. Because when you subscribe, it helps push the video to more people or more viewers. Yeah, so please help me subscribe. It's completely free of charge. It doesn't cost anything. Please subscribe. Like this video if you enjoyed it. And comment, share with your friends. And let's meet in the next video. Bye.